right. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, got another one here. Uh, style and profile, and great follower of the show. Uh, good day, boys. Quick question for Jason: Have you got any Triple H stories? Yeah, sure. Yeah, Triple H was. Uh, he was really. Um, I think he really helped me get the, the opportunity of the job. I was, you know, when I was bugging Carl DeMarco during those times, I was showing up at these. Uh, what was it called? Uh, home shopping networks, and uh, so home shopping network shows that the the Fed would be doing with home shopping network. So I would show up to those and I'd be doing impressions. But Hunter and China, they really liked me and they got me in to um, doing those impressions. They got me doing more on those um, home shopping gigs. And then when I when I would met Vince at TSN, this was already the time that Hunter was already office then. And he was traveling oh. around with Vince. And he was there with Vince and China was there. and so. China and Hunter also put me over to Vince after I did the impressions. And then when I got in, it was almost like they took me under their wing. Like Hunter and China were so nice to me. They really treated me good. And uh, it was like, he was awesome with me. And uh, probably the reason I was in DX, probably the reason I got over. But, uh, you know, as time went on, when, um, you know, there's a long story of why I wasn't on TV because I got caught at the border and I, you know, then Owen passed away and they didn't want me on to remind people of Owen, you know, and then when China and Hunter broke up and uh, Hunter was with Stephanie, I was done. Stephanie just didn't like me for some reason and Hunter started treating me differently and that was the end of it. And it's just too bad. But uh, before that, it was like I was China's boy now. But before that, Hunter really was instrumental in helping me. Wow. Yeah, too bad. Well, obviously, your car at the border, was it like a visa issue or something? Yeah. And and, and me, I was all like marked out. Like I was just on, I was on Raw now. So I'm dressed up the same way I'm dressed on Raw. I'm eating up all the, uh, you know, all the recognition every time I go somewhere right. and uh, I'm walking through to get to, to the airport and immigration comes at me. We seen you on raw last week. Well, yeah, cause I'm wearing the exact same clothes. <laughs> That's when people <laughs> actually watch the show. <laughs> yeah, like 8 million people a, a week watching it. Right. That's true. Yeah. So yeah, there was a lot of recognition. It was pretty cool. Yeah. But uh, yeah. So then they brought me in that brick and interrogation room and I was not allowed to cross the border unless I wasn't on contract yet. And they were getting me to lie. It's like I kept telling them, I can't keep lying. Like, it's okay. Just tell them. Uh, Kevin Dunn, he's like, just tell them uh, Russo's your dad or something. Wow. <laughs> tell yeah, them Russo's your dad. Resemblance is uncanny. 